Hey guys, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel. So this is haul three in a four part series. If you haven't watched the first two, I'll link them so you can go back and watch them. But basically these are items that were gifted to me um, to resell and it is the second time this person has actually gifted me items. Today we're going to talk about all the leather jackets. Yeah. Okay. When I opened up this box of leather jackets, I almost fell on the ground. Almost fell on the ground because, oh my, this is dreamy. This is like the dreamy. I want to keep everything and I can't because that would be silly, but everything is my size. It is the dreamiest stuff. All amazing pieces. So yes, these items are free. I didn't pay anything for them. Um, I've told the story a bunch. I'm not going to tell it again, but you can go back and watch the videos. Um, part of the proceeds will end up going to charity, but this is, I am so grateful and I don't even have like words to say how incredible this, this, this is to me. So anyway, um, in total, they have about $10,000 in retail. If you watched my handbag video from the one I put up before this one, um, it was also about $10,000 in retail. And then there was a big like jean haul. Um, so I think so far we're at about $25,000 in retail of product that was given to me. Um, tomorrow we're actually going to go over the shoes that she gifted me as well as the belts. So stick tight for that. And let's dive in, shall we? Okay. I'm so excited, you guys. These are, it's going to be hard to part with these, but we're going to, we're going to dive in. So first things first, um, we have some vests. So this is a gorgeous All Saints vest. I really want to try some of these on because I can. They are all my size. So this is All Saints. This is a size 14 and it is just this perfect Oh, look at this moto vest. If I was cool and I had style, I would totally wear this, but I'm really not that cool. And I just live in like athleisure. Look at this. I want to like go get a job in the corporate world or something. So I have reasons to wear these clothes, but I guess I could just like wear them. I don't know. I love this vest. So anyway, gorgeous. Yes, we love this vest. Okay. Um, this is All Saints. I don't know exactly how much it retailed for, but it is a size 14, like I said, and I have no idea what I'll list it at either. But gorgeous leather. Okay, I'm gonna stop saying gorgeous leather, but it's so hard. This is another All Saints vest. This one's a size 12, and this one's cool because it's like a hooded leather vest. <laughs> Let's get you guys back a little bit. We go. So we have a hooded leather vest. Right? Like, can't you guys just see me wearing this stuff? I feel like I feel like I'm cool enough to wear these sort of things. I don't know if you have to be cool or not. You just have to pull it off. Okay. So this is another just beautiful. I have to try them on because when am I ever gonna get the chance to try on this stuff again? I mean, I guess I could go to the store and just try it on, but it's not like I'm buying it. I don't think I've ever spent a thousand dollars on a single piece of clothing. And that's about how much all of these would have retailed for. So here we are. Okay. I'm going to put you back. This one I'm actually probably keeping. I took it for a test drive, meaning I wore it around to see if I liked it. Um, and I think I like it enough to keep it. And I don't have like a good leather jacket. So I will make a donation to the charity. The sleeves are a little tight, but it is brand new. So leather, you have to break in. Um, so this is a the another All Saints jacket. It is a quilted leather moto jacket. Again, like a little tight, but hey, I think I'm gonna start working out again, lose some quarantine weight, and <sighs> I just really like this jacket. <laughs> Okay, let me know. Do you guys think I should keep this jacket or should I sell this jacket? It is brand new with tags, but I also love it. It's debatable. 
So, man, there it is. There's this beautiful jacket that retailed for at least a thousand dollars. Okay, I'll say this jacket. It is a small, isn't it? Maybe I shouldn't keep this. Maybe I should pass it on to the next person. Here's the tag. Hi, I love you. <laughs> this is a weird haul, you guys, because I'm just obsessed. I'm obsessed. This is my favorite, like, all of this. These are my favorite pieces I've ever gotten from anyone, ever. Uh, another leather piece. This is a different brand. So this is Vita. Um, this brand is sold on places like Revolve. Very high-end um, leather pieces. And this is a super soft leather vest. What type of leather are you? I'm guessing lambskin. She has an affinity. She loves lambskin. Lip lamb leather. So this is a lamb leather vest. If you guys have never touched lamb leather, <laughs> I don't even know how to put into words what this feels like. It feels so soft, which seems weird, but here we are with a soft leather jacket. Um, the next one here is another Vita piece. And this one's cool. It is a Vita leather jacket, but the sleeves are leather and then the body is wool. It needs to be lint rolled, but that's fine. It's a size large. This is also a beautiful piece. I don't know if I can fit into a large these days, but let's try, shall we? Ooh. Oh, I can't. Okay, all right. Oh, this is fine. Okay, cool. Look, I feel better about myself already. Okay. This is cute. I could get down with this. That's interesting. So it buttons like this, but it's still, so the buttons are like here, here, and here. So it still looks asymmetric when you have it buttoned. Oh, I like this. I like this one a lot. Okay. I'm gonna keep one thing. So you guys have to help me decide. What should I keep? What should I keep? I'm going to treat myself to one thing. I'm going to do it, I'm gonna buy it. And yeah, which one? Next we have another gorgeous piece. This is a helmet laying um, leather sleeve, like a blazer. And is the back has leather? The back like has a leather elastic at the bottom. So I'm not gonna try this on because this isn't one of the pieces that I wanna keep, but I will say that this retailed for a lot. Um, then we have a Nuba, and this is sold on sites like Revolve again. Uh, there it is, N-U-U-U-B-A-A. -A. And this is another just quilted leather vest. So pretty. And this is a Muba, sorry, Muba. I believe this is, what kind of fabric is this? Leather? No. Size 16. What are you made out of? Oh, what? Okay, this is so soft that I didn't think it was leather, but it's goat leather. So, what is that life? Okay, goat leather is apparently softer than lamb's leather. Just so FYI, just a little, little tidbit that you and I just found out together. And it is lined. Oh, it's a UK 16, so it's a US 12. Let's see what it looks like, shall we? Oh, this is cool because the sleeves have the stretchy. So, you know, mom arms over here. Okay. Hi, my name's Nicole and this jacket's gorgeous. Hello. It, yes, this is leather. This is goat's leather and I love it. So here we are with this goat's leather jacket, which is just gorgeous. Um, and again, I'm like incredibly grateful for this stuff. Um, I'm not... I don't know how to react because I've never been given such an amazing gift before. And it, I don't, I, I what do you do? You say thank you. So I'm very thankful. Oh man, the postman's here. My dog's gonna get real mad in a second. I thought the postman already came because the dog already got really mad, but apparently he's coming again because I just saw him. No 
Nope, there it is. Selfie, no. Hi. Don't do it. Don't do it. He's gone. Oh my gosh, he's coming back. No way. No way he's coming back a third time. Why? Hi, you guys are doing this haul video? I should edit all this out, but what fun would that be? It wouldn't be. There it is. My dog hates the postman. He's leaving. Okay, I think we're good. He's not turning around this time. And she's not totally freaking out. It's, this is a first. This is just a basic uh, Tarte collection, like tank top. This isn't anything fancy, um, but it is soft and pretty and I like it and it's on brand for what she likes to wear. Next is this, which I am obsessed with. This is so cute. I love a crop top right now, super into them. Um, this is a Vita. It's a knit crop and it ties in the front or the back. I don't know. You, you tie it somehow and love this. We love this, right? This is really cute. I really like this brand. I want to find more pieces for them and, you know, build my dream closet, which is basically this dream closet. This is a pair of um, wide leg pants. And here's the um, store that came from. This is a really high end store in Seattle. I don't know if it's going to show you. I think they actually went out of business during the pandemic. Um, I saw a whole article about it. It's T-O-T-O-K-A-E-L-O. But these are a pair of base range um, Martin skirt pants. And I sold from her first lot a pair of, uh, it was a base range sweater. And it definitely had a following. So I was excited to see that brand in there again. But I show you the tag. This is a base range tag. If you ever see that tag, grab it. Okay, we have a, another pair of pants, and these are just a linen, like, tapered leg pant with attached suspender things, and this is by M-U-K-U, -U, which is kind of like, just like a goth alternative brand. I don't want to say goth necessarily, but kind of that style. And this, okay, I have to show you a picture of this on the internet, because it's really cool, but it's hard to, like, make out what this is. So I have my handy dandy iPad and I have to show you what this is. So this is a helmet Lang. Yes, I'm using a ring light. Um, this is a helmet Lang leather shirt and that's what it looks like when it's on. Look at that, like the cool raw edge. Hi. Oh, and then here's the price. It was, um, $695 brand new and here is mine which I believe is also new without tags. Hi. What? Cool. Love this. Right? We love this. This is really cool. So this is just a helmet laying like raw trimmed asymmetrical leather shirt, but it looks much better on the model than just on the hanger. And that's the haul. So that's all the leather goods, um, or the leather like jackets and random stuff my favorite. This is my favorite. This is just my favorite. I don't know how many times I'm going to say that. I am incredibly grateful. I'm so excited to get this stuff listed and to figure out what I should keep. So again, like, please leave a comment and tell me which one you think looks best so I can um, buy it and keep it for myself. So thanks for hanging out today, guys. I'll be back again tomorrow with the shoe haul, which is exciting. Look at these, like sneak peek. These are Trippin. Like literally that's a brand name. Trippin shoes. Um, lots of great shoes here. Not a ton. Last time there was more shoes, but last time there was not leather jacket. So, woo! I cannot wait to show you guys the shoes. And that will be in the belt. And then that will be a wrap up. She also gave me a bunch of intimates, like bras and stuff. But I honestly don't think I'm going to do a video about them. Because, um, maybe I will. I don't know. I have a big box of intimates as well. So, we'll see. But I am going to do the shoe video for sure. She's in belts tomorrow. So, come back for that. And let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you again. Thanks for watching. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up. And subscribe if you haven't yet. Bye.